as the heat advisory extends for another day. Everyone is looking for ways to stay cool, and that includes students, teachers, coaches, and bus drivers. Yeah, I talked to some of those folks today to see what precautions are being taken outside of the classroom. It's a scorching reality bus drivers and bus riders have been dealing with this week. School buses reaching high temperatures like this local bus clocked at 106 degrees. School bus drivers we talked to say they're keeping windows all the way down, encouraging kids to fill up water bottles before they get on the bus, and even keep an ice pack in that lunchbox to help them cool down. One, two, three, cats! For the kids staying after school for sports, the Indiana High School Athletic Association is recommending several precautions to coaches. It's a huge issue across the country and, and one we pay particular attention to. As many sports have started their fall seasons over the past few weeks, Robert Falcons, the assistant commissioner of IHSAA, says it's important for coaches to help athletes acclimate to these temperatures. We want to get kids and athletes prepared to compete uh, in extreme conditions. They don't want them to compete in extreme conditions, but they can. Still, boom. Balkan says they're also asking coaches to limit practicing twice a day and get creative with where and when they're practicing. We'll go inside. We'll practice later. We'll practice early in the morning. Falcon says schools can even make changes prior to and during games or meets. We may delay the start of the game an hour until the temperature cools. Uh, we'll have forced timeouts during the periods where we stop the game. Several schools have postponed or moved practices or competition. MSD of Lawrence Township Schools has athletic trainers monitor outside conditions to ensure it's safe for student athletes to compete. Some events this afternoon have been postponed. What we don't want to have happen is, is endangering of our athletes because we've not taken the precautions that we know of uh, that will prevent uh, exertional heat stroke. Times or postponing practices would come from each school to make sure to look out for any changes as this heat continues. A